Okay, here's another homemade Stirling engine that uh, I recommend if you're pretty good with tools. And this is the Easy Stirling engine, E, capital E, capital Z, Stirling engine by my Ford boy. And uh, it's made out of a, <clears throat> a candy tin normally. This is a different tin. I, I got it here in the U.S. Uh, on eBay. It's five centimeters shorter and I'm using a foam displacer. It's a sponge. And I think I've got a regenerator type thing going on with that right there. But uh, this is quite a little project. It takes days. It's not something you do in the afternoon. But uh, fun and does work. And if you go to my Ford Boy uh, blog or look at his videos here at YouTube, you'll see this uh, Sterling engine. And uh, great project it was fun but it's like I say it's something if you're good with tools if you're not handy with tools uh, just make the soda pop ones but uh, uh, this was quite uh, quite interesting I, I enjoyed building this one and I'm sure uh, my Ford boy will be glad that somebody else has produced one of his engines um, I don't like the fact that the uh, diaphragm the latex diaphragm is built into this to the point where you can't easily replace it and I poked a hole in it with a little screwdriver and patched it with some contact cement but uh, the motor is one of these things that you've got to be real careful with almost everything you do on it and you see I've got this running on a candle and uh, you just tape the can together with uh, tape of some kind I'm using a high temperature electrical tape and then if you want to put some uh, cold on the top, I have these little uh, ice cube things I put on here to help it. And it goes a little bit better. But it's not a very fast Sterling engine. And he didn't want it that way. But uh, good little project. And like I say, if you're handy with tools, uh, or if you've got the tools in your garage or shop, this is a great little project. Just don't expect to do it in an afternoon. The structure is wood, and you have to get all those pieces on that structure correct. And if you're not careful with it, with your gluing and everything, it really throws everything off. But um, anyway, that's the uh, the My Ford Boy EZ Sterling engine, and I do recommend it. Uh, Maybe not as your very first Sterling engine. Thanks for watching.